Dear students, Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are fine. Today I am with the second lecture on Dettol. And today I am going to discuss the preparation reactions of chlorogylinol, the main component of Dettol, that is 4 chloro 3 5 dimethylphenol. This is the compound 4 chloro 3 5 dimethylphenol. And this compound is prepared from this compound. Dear students, do you know what the name of this compound is? Okay, let's see. First of all, we have to number the carbon atoms of the benzene ring to determine the name of this compound. Let's see. This is carbon number one. This is carbon number two. This is carbon number three, four, five, six. Another thing, we have to know that is azo means nitrogen and di azo means two nitrogen atoms di means two azo means nitrogen so di azo means two nitrogen atoms now let's see here we see at carbon 3 one methyl group and at carbon 5 another methyl group so we can tell 3,5 dimethyl and there is a benzene ring. So 3,5 dimethyl benzene here diazo, diazo then chlorine. Now we can tell 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. Now we got the name of this compound that is 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. Dear students, let's write the name of this compound. It's a big name, so the name is 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. From this compound, the main component of Dettol will be prepared stepwise. Now let's see the steps one by one. Step one, preparation of 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. This compound is prepared in two ways. First of all, we can prepare this compound from benzene diazonium chloride. When benzene diazonium chloride is treated with methyl iodide in presence of dry aluminium chloride, then meta hydrogen atoms, that is hydrogen atoms present in meta positions, are replaced by methyl electrophile. These meta hydrogen atoms are replaced by methyl electrophile and 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride is produced. We should know one thing that is, methyl electrophile is replacing hydrogen atoms from the meta position, not from the ortho or para positions. Why? We should know. One thing is written here that is the structure formula of benzene diazonium chloride. Here we see at the top of the nitrogen atom there is a positive charge and chloride is and this this is chloride ion like sodium chloride. Sodium chloride is a salt this is a kind of salt because of this positive charge ortho positions and para position become electronically deficient and comparatively this position is suitable for this electrophile that is why this electrophile replaces hydrogen atoms of the meta position okay next go to the second way from which we can produce 
3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. The second way from which we can produce 3,5 dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. And in this case, we have to take 3,5 dimethyl nitrobenzene. This 3,5 dimethyl nitrobenzene is treated with tin and ACL. That means concentrated hydrochloric acid. This compound produces hydrogen, which reduces this nitro group to aniline group. And then we get 3,5 dimethyl aniline. Now, this compound is treated with sodium nitrite and concentrated ACL. This sodium nitrite and concentrated ACL produces nitrous acid and sodium chloride. Now, this compound reacts with nitrous acid and hydrochloric acid. And then we get 3,5-dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride at the temperature 0 to 5 degrees Celsius. This reaction is maintained this at this temperature that is uh, low temperature. If this temperature is not maintained, then at high temperature, this compound is broken down and then we will not get our desired compound. So this is the, these are the two ways by which we can uh, produce 3,5-dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. Step 2, preparation of 3,5-dimethyl phenol. And from step 1, we got 3,5-dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride. From this compound, we have to prepare 3,5-dimethyl phenol. And in this case, the 3,5-dimethyl benzene diazonium chloride is hydrolyzed in presence of acid and at the temperature 40 degrees Celsius. Then this, this group is converted to OH group and we get 3,5-dimethyl phenol. Now, let's see the next step. Step 3, that means last step to prepare chlorogyrinol, the main component of Dettol. And in this case, the compound obtained from step 2, that means 3,5-dimethylphenol, is treated with firstly chlorine in presence of iron. Then the parahydrogen is replaced by chlorine and we get 4 chloro 35 dimethyl phenol in another way we can produce our main component from this compound and here this compound is treated with sulfuryl chloride in presence of carbon tetrachloride the name of this compound is sulfuryl chloride When this compound is treated with sulfuryl chloride in presence of carbon tetrachloride, then parahydrogen is replaced by chlorine and we get the main component of Dettol, that means 4-chloro-3,5-dimethylphenol. Dear students, two more points. One is Sablon and another one is Salol. Sablon is a mixture of chlorohexidine gluconate it is 0.3% and another component is centrimide, it is 3%. It is used in surgery cases, especially wound washing or mouth washing, this compound is used. Another one is salol. Salol is another antiseptic and it is phenyl salicylate. Phenyl salicylate is the formula of phenyl salicylate, this is salicylic acid or orthohydroxy benzoic acid. When this hydrogen is replaced by phenyl group, then we get phenyl salicylate. This is the main component of cellulose. Okay, dear students, that's all about Dettol.